Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing another requested video. Um, Gigi from Gigi Nail and Stuff asked me what my setup looked like if I had a video for that. And I do have an old one, but a lot of things have changed. Um, as you can see in front of us here is my manicure station. Now, this thing folds down into a cube. Um, let me, let me kind of give you a little idea. It turns into a cube like that that top piece just folds down. The leg folds under it and it folds down, but it's, it doesn't ever get done like that. <laughs> so what I have here is a very long, tall tripod that um, takes up a lot of floor space. I've got my little stool down there because, <laughs> you know, I'm a short person, so i got to have a stool. i got my little paper towels down there, but that has nothing to do with filming. What I'm trying to get to is here. Now, that is my new light ring that I got for Christmas. I believe it's a 24-inch one. I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, and then above it, I've got um, a kind of an accordion-style lamp and then a old manicure lamp from, like, way back in the day. Um, it's just a straight lamp. It does not put off a lot of light, but it does add something to it. So um, that is what we've got going on there. I'm going to change positions and give you a view of this setup from another angle. Okay, so this is my work area right here. And as you can see, the little um, ring light sits right above it. The thing I love about this one is it's got a, like a little niche back here that has a thing that I can just slide it in for my camera. And it makes it easy for battery and, um, you know, changing out memory cards and you can just slide it back in. And I can do that with ease, even with wet nails. Um, also, this will unscrew and I can raise the light or lower it, um, depending on what I'm doing. If I'm water marbling, I would definitely want to raise it up quite a bit. And Okay, that battery cut me off. I'm like the queen of dead batteries. And I think I have like six batteries for each of my cameras. It's ridiculous. So, over here in this corner, I have my light box and two OT lamps. OT lamps are supposed to help with showing more true to color. Um, yet to be determined on my end. <laughs> um, I'm not real crazy about this light box. It needs some um, ironing because the back panel is all wrinkled from being stored in the closet. But I've decided I'm going to give it another go and see if I can make this work. And if not, I will be doing a DIY um, light box like the other ladies on YouTube because um, I really do want to be able to get good still photos of my manicures to share. So that is my setup. Um, once again, battery cut me off. Um, anyway, so what I was saying was um, I'm filming with a Coolpix S6900. It's just a little digital camera with a memory card. Um, nothing fancy. Um, I do have a dream camera. Maybe one day I will get it. And um, we'll see. <laughs> then I'll have to learn something new. But um, I was using my old Coolpix camera um, for my still photos, and that's what I was recording on until just a minute ago. Um, I went to change the battery out, and it looks like it's dead. So, it looks like this camera, my Coolpix S6900, is going to be my filming camera and my swatch photo camera. So, that is what I'm using. That is what I do. Um, if you have any questions, um, please leave them for me down below. If you got any comments, suggestions, uh, I like seeing all of it. So, um, that is it. So, um, Gigi, thanks for asking me to film this or asking, you know, to see how I have my setup. I love seeing other people's setups, and that's how mine has evolved over the years. I, I've, I was just talking to Sister Chic the other day about how many different lighting systems and cameras and tripods and different software I've tried using and it's it's just you know I'm always trying to improve and make my channel and my quality of my videos better um, without having to take a you know a photography class because that's not something I'm interested in I'm interested in manicures and um, 
I don't want to spend money on a class and have to go to class. So um, I have tried to teach myself on YouTube, and I do really enjoy seeing how others have their setups. Some of what I have has come from other YouTubers that have shared their setups. So we all learn from each other. It's a good thing. So that is all I have for today. I would like to thank you for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.